standing in my bathroom, and you may ask why. And it's not because sound in here is horrible with all the echoing. It's because, well, I have children on the other end of the house, and they're being noisy, and I want to record this video right now. And normally I go outside for this, but it's hot. I live in Florida. Anyway, this is a follow-up video to a video I posted not too long ago, uh, Secret Message. Um, which was a very simple secret message, and we're going to have a quick look at how to decode that today. It was just kind of a barely hidden QR code, um, but definitely, I, I hope to do more videos like that. It's something I've wanted to do for a long time, um, and definitely get a lot more complicated uh, than that one, which was pretty simple, although, you know, some people might, you know, see things quicker than others. Um, so we're going to look at, at decoding that you know, basically QR code, um, but there's a few steps to get to that point uh, today in this video. Uh, but I also hope to do more videos like this. It's not going to take the place of other videos. It's just going to be like every once in a while I'll just make a random video with a secret message and then like a week or so later I'll show you how to solve that secret message. And there's no rewards or prizes. Usually the end result will link you to a YouTube video where you can comment and say, hey, I made it here. Yay! You know, um, just so you can claim your fame. A uh, few things about the first video I posted. First of all, I don't know. Maybe you guys don't like this because it had a lot of thumbs down. I think there were four, currently, there are four thumbs up and four thumbs down. So half people didn't like this. And I don't know why. I don't know if it's because it was too hard for them. I don't know if it was because it was too easy. Or they just don't like secret messages. Um, but we'll see. I, 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 like I said, I've, I, I think about this sort of thing when I'm just out and about. I'm like, oh, it'd be cool if I did a secret code like this or a secret code like that. And um, so, again, this one was real simple. We'll look at it now, and there'll be more difficult ones in the future, but let me know in the comments below. Does this sort of thing, thing, thing seem fun to you? And, you know, my channel is mainly about learning, but the second part of it is about community and just having fun with one another. And I've really, over the years, tried to get my viewers to be more interactive, and there has been a few of you, um, but I just thought this would be more thing, you know, we can interact. and. Uh, the only thing I ask, and I asked this, you know, I had annotations in the original video and people kind of ignored it, is when you get the answer to the video, don't post it in the comments. Go to the link where it's providing and post your comments there. Don't ruin the fun for other people, okay? Um, I know me saying that's not going to help, but let's go ahead and look at decoding that simple QR code now. Okay, so this we're just going to solve that simple QR code. Uh, so first, download the YouTube video at the best quality you can. I like using YouTube DL, uh, but whatever technique you use will be great. So let me go ahead and I'm going to copy and I'm going to paste in the URL to the video. And it will, shouldn't take long, it's like a 12 second video. There we go. So we have that downloaded. So next, what we want to do is we want to extract a frame from it. You could open it up in a video editor like uh, Caden Live, and then just say extract frame. Uh, I'm going to use I'm going to use F FFmpeg because that's what I normally use. Give it the input of our video. So FFmpeg dash I input of the video uh, dash dash uh, no just one dash SS zero zero colon zero zero colon zero zero actually zero one there. So what I'm saying here is just go to the first second of the video, and we're going to say V frame one, which is saying extract one frame, and we're going to put it output.png. Uh, so again, ffmpeg, and then dash i for the input, and we give it the name of the video we just downloaded, and then dash ss for, you know, the second that we want to go to, which it's the same image throughout the entire video. I'm just saying go to one second and extract uh, a frame, just one frame, and I'll put it to there. Hit enter, and now if we list, you can see that obviously I must have typed something wrong. Um, v frame, oh, sorry, it's V frames with an S. There we go. So now we have an output PNG, which I can display real quick. Which right here, and if you look close enough, you can see that there's QR code in there. And in fact, uh, in Image Magic here, I could probably uh, edit this and, uh, and adjust it. I could do that. Enhancements. So I was going to go into GIMP because that's what I would normally use. Um, let me just go into GIMP because that's what I was planning on doing. But you could use Image Magic in the GUI there or Image Magic from the command line to adjust the picture. But I'm just going to say uh, go to GIMP 
And a lot of the uh, viewers were right. You could open this up and you can either uh, go to colors threshold and it would give you the QR code. I haven't tested that, but people said it worked. What I did was I just went to contra brightness and contrast and turned the contrast all the way up. Because the way I created this image was I turned the contrast all the way down and, and then moved it up one, one degree, you know. So go ahead and do that. We'll go ahead and we'll export that. And then we will close this. So now if I display output.png, you can see it's our new image. And then I'm gonna use Z bar IMG, which you can install, the package is called uh, zbar-tools. I've done videos on this before. Give it an image and it'll find all types of barcodes, both QR codes and standard, uh, um, you know, standard barcodes like UPCs and stuff. We'll go ahead and we'll hit enter on that. And you'll see that it gives you a URL here. And then you can go to that URL and comment again. I'm gonna hopefully do more secret video, secret message videos like this just for fun. Uh, and when you solve them, again, don't comment on the secret message comments on how to get there or where it leads. Go to the actual video because that's where it will normally lead, or a link on my site or something. I don't even know. Uh, but you can comment after you solve it, not on the posting, because you don't want to ruin it for other people. But that is it. Uh, it's that simple. I thank you for watching. Be sure to check out my, my website, filmsbychris.com. That's Chris the K. There should be a link in the description. Be sure to subscribe, share, like, comment. Uh, and as always, I hope that you have a great day.